We begin with Michael Strahan's scare. A 25-year-old homeless man was arrested and taken down by cops after he allegedly threatened and tried to kill the ABC host with a serrated knife. Go ahead. No, 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 no. All right, thanks, guys. This morning, Michael made no mention of the incident. He didn't even know about it until hours after it happened. Why celebrities don't talk about their stalkers. They don't want to give them that notoriety that the stalker is seeking. By mentioning their name, sometimes these celebrities don't know they have a stalker. This video of Michael and Kelly Ripa on Monday shows just how exposed and unprotected the hosts are. You can see here there's just a few low metal barricades, just one guard visible, and fans just about 10 feet away. Strahan often walks to work. So does Matt Lauer, and Regis used to do the same. Michael also tweets photos of himself in Central Park and posing with fans, allowing them easy access. L.A. prosecutor Rhonda Saunders, who wrote Whisper of Fear, a book explaining the psychology of stalking, breaks down the danger. Celebrities are more vulnerable to stalkers nowadays because of the Internet. In the old days, the stalkers would have to hunt down their prey. Anchors exposed, stars attacked on red carpets, but what helped save Strahan was the fast-acting guard and NYPD. Security expert Jamie Salenga says they're trained to react quickly. To look at someone who seems out of place, or if they're a little bit, um, you know, too excited to be there, so to speak. Most fans are, are just wonderful. It will not change the way we behave. While the court date for Strahan suspect is still on hold, Sandra Bullock's accused stalker, who cops say broke into her home last month while she was there in an L.A. court today. Yes, Sean. Joshua James Corbett's prelim hearing set for August 21st. In June, he pled not guilty to 19 felony counts. No one was hurt, but Saunders explains why some fans crossed the line. It's a combination of wanting revenge, anger, and notoriety.